Well, one of the biggest stories going into the grand final is cat skipper Joel Selwood. Can he become a premiership skipper? He's done so much in his career. He's with Cat Watman. With the Geelong skipper Joel Selwood. Joel, this is when it really starts to kick in. Feels like you're playing in a grand final tomorrow. Oh, it's been pretty special a week to be honest, Cat. But it's nice to get to Melbourne and. Um, the fans have come out like they have all final series. It's, uh, it's actually been quite amazing. Do you cherish this sort of build-up more when you're nearing the end of your career compared to the start? You're pushing me out. <laughs> you no, know, not at all. <laughs> no, you do. I mean, any time you get a moment like this, you make sure you take it in because it's, um, it's just so special what our game can do for so many. Is it true you're going to be running out with Gary Ablett Jr.'s son Levi tomorrow? Is that what I've heard? Oh, maybe. I may have put my foot in it a little bit earlier, but... Um, we, as a club, we thought it'd be really special if uh, we could make a moment of it. Um, watch yourself there. I'm all over it. Uh, but yeah, he will be playing a part. Just finally, I'm going to talk to your coach, Chris Scott, but what about the job he's done the past 12 months in reinvigorating this team? Yeah, I mean, um, shouldn't just put it down to the last 12 months. He's been unbelievable along the journey and um, just getting a bit of reward for all the effort at the moment. Who's he got on his lap, by the way? That's his daughter, Layla. Go have a chat to them. Good luck tomorrow, Joel. Thank you. Cheers, Scott. What a legend he is, Joel Selwood, playing in his 40th final tomorrow. That is going to be a new record. And this man, the coach of the Geelong Football Club, Chris Scott. Chris, I might grab you for a few words. You've got your daughter on your lap. Yes, yeah, uh, we're both loving it. It's fantastic. How proud are you of Dad? And he's in another grand final as coach. Yeah, I'm happy for him, and I'm really proud that he made it this far. Does Dad have a favourite player? sure but I'm pretty sure he, lo he loves all the players. Who's your favourite player? Um, well I have four, Jeremy Cameron, Patrick Dangerfield, Joel Selwood and um, hang up. I'm sure. Well it's hard to have favourites but they're all my favourite. <laughs> this must be so special sharing it with your daughter. Yeah it sure is. I, I, think, I think it's just good for everyone after the last few years to get back and um, you know, this is what footy is all about, so it's a real privilege to be part of it. Can you enjoy this moment, or in the back of your mind, are you still thinking about matchups and tactics and what if scenarios? Uh, no, I can enjoy it, but it is funny. We're about to have a meeting in an hour or so, so um, I'd better get my thoughts together pretty quickly. Finally, can I ask you a question about Max Holmes? How's he doing? Yeah, it's actually looking good. So we were uh, in the position where we were hoping we could make a decision this morning, and it's certainly not a no, so we'll just keep trying to tick the boxes, but it's looking promising. Good news. I'll let you enjoy this with your daughter. Thanks, Kath. Later.